Well, this blows my fucking mind. Roy Big Cunt Nelson beats Justin Wren. Episode 9, Season 10 of The Ultimate Fighter. Um, now, you see... You guys know me, right? I'm high, right? If I'm awake, I'm fucking high. How fucking high would you have to be to decide that Roy Nelson beats Justin Wren? You would have to be high to the point of fucking retarded. In my opinion, Justin Wren dominated the first round. Octagon control, he pushed the pace of the fight, he threw more, I feel he landed more. Um, maybe Roy Big Cunt Nelson, maybe he fucking did a little bit better in the second round. Um, but that would be 1-1. One, one. So where the fuck is the third round? That fat goof, that fat turd fucking mouthpiece goof of a person. Fucking Roy Big Fucking Cunt Nelson. Really? The fuck is this? The Ray Charles School of MMA judging? What the fuck is going on? It has nothing to do with the fact that I fucking hate Roy Big Cunt Nelson. Nothing to do with that. Let's just be fucking right or let's just be fucking wrong. Dana White had the hardest fucking time reading that decision last night. That's fucking bullshit. In every sport where it's left to judging, it's a fucking epidemic in the Olympics. It sucks balls in boxing. MMA is just the fucking same. When it goes to the judges, who the fuck knows what's going to happen? What always happens is, is people are getting fucked in the ass. That's exactly what the fuck is going on. No matter how high you are, you can't fucking watch that fight and say that Roy Big Cunt Nelson dominated any fucking portion of that fight. Fucking unbelievable. fucking blows me away. I'm laying in bed last night watching this shit and uh, I fucking jumped out of bed and screamed, what the fuck? Roy Big Cunt Nelson? Like, did they get the fucking name switched up on the fucking scorecards? Like, what the fuck? Totally fucking disgusted. I love when Dana White talks about Roy Big Cunt Nelson. I really do. And it really wasn't that long ago till I started watching Dana White video blogs, learning more about him other than just what Tito Ortiz says. And because I'm a Tito Ortiz fan, I've been biased, you know, to what Tito says about him. But Dana White hates that motherfucker. Dana White hates Roy Nelson. And I love when Dana White talks about him. Fucking, fucking, fuck. Like I said, it must have been the Ray Charles School of fucking mixed martial arts judging. That is some fucking bullshit. Justin Wren got fucking robbed. Nothing more, nothing fucking less. Maybe it should have went to a third round, and I honestly don't know that Justin Wren would have made it out of the third round. He looked pretty fucking gassed. But, majority decision, Roy Big Cunt Nelson, really? I'm be fucking leaveable. I'm not a religious person by no stretch of the words, but, uh, I pray that, like, a fucking satellite orbiting in fucking space just happens to fall out of the sky, fall through the roof of that house, injure nobody else but land on Roy Big Cunt Nelson. Fucking fat goof. Run fucking circles around that fat piece of shit. Remember the movie Little Giants? I'd even tell them, you're gonna fuck around, I leave footprints up your fat back. Fucking douchebag. I fucking... 
I don't know. I'm going to review this, and I'm going to post this motherfucker, and I'm going to count how many times I said fuck. Probably quite a fucking few. Oh, fuck. Roy, big cunt, Nelson. Really? If he makes it into the fucking UFC, which I already know that he never would, because Dana White wouldn't sign him, because Dana White hates him. But I'd give up watching UFC and watch, like, fucking senior ladies lawn bowling or fucking... I'm the fucking leaveable.